Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today we have got some rec center gameplay here on NBA 2K22 Next Gen. If you missed it yesterday, we posted some My Career. Today we're actually going into the city. We're playing some rec. I'm sure we'll get into park in the very near future. But first, going to try out some rec. Just going to see if it's any different this year. I doubt it because how do you really change rec? You don't. But I'm a 78 overall right now. Haven't played much park. Played like two games. So I'm a level two. Um, again, just grinding My Career right now. Don't have all the VC in the world. Still 78. We'll see what happens. I'm using currently a small forward build. I'm using, uh, I think it's, yes, yeah, the Stax Montana build. So I don't know, just trying it out. Again, could change it in the near future. But we are going to be the black team today. We are an 82 overall combined, taking on the white team, who is an 89 overall. Because, of course, um, yeah, my team is me and a bunch of randos. Except for number two is my guy Kingson TV. His link will be in the description down below. And also, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below for some more NBA 2K22 here on the channel. We're going to be playing some park later. And we're just going to be playing some stuff here in NBA 2K22 alongside our uh, My NBA Mode franchise with the Atlanta Hawks. So let's get this game underway. Their team is pretty damn good. So that's just a little bit concerning. Uh, my matchup, I guess, small forward, his XP level is level 5. Okay, we start this game off here. Um, again, my team is pretty solid, I guess. I'm not the best player on this team, just overall-wise. And, okay, they're going to get things started with a big 3 from the top of the key. So we're down 3 nothing here. Um, the guy with the star logo under his name... I pretty much our best player if i'll just keep it real um the guy with the red here is solid as well I and mean, then our center was pretty decent too uh kingston tv is like a 60 overall so he's not great but i'm gonna get the scoring started for myself making that mid-range shot and giving our team the lead four to three we're gonna leave a guy wide open in the corner and he's gonna hit that three if you leave anyone wide open in this game, it feels like in previous 2K games, you could leave dudes wide open and they'd still miss shots. This year, it really isn't that way. I'm going to kick to the corner. Don't know why that guy's taking that shot. Very late release as well. Not great. So the white team gets the ball back. We leave him in the corner again. Not great defense being played. That's not my guy in the corner, but he's going to hit that three green light. And we are now down by five at nine to four. So we get the ball back. Our star player right here in the corner is going to work his way. He's going to drive baseline and kick it back to the center. Back out for a mid-range shot. Green light. The score is now six to nine. Pretty nice right there. We get the ball back off the inbound. Guy's wide open under the hoop, and he will put it in. And it is now a one-point game. I'm not going to touch the ball much. I'll keep it real with you. It's just not going to happen. Um, the guy with the star under his feet held the ball a lot in this game. I do believe he was coming into this game playing already with the center or number six. So those two were really passing the ball to each other a lot. I'm going to give it up to him, though, right there. And he's going to drive in and make that layup. So I do get an assist there. And now it is a two-point game. The white team, though, back with the ball. Their entire team, it's its five out the entire time. They're just trying to spread the ball, shoot it from three. And now we are down by five. I'm open in the corner there, but we're going to drive in, miss that layup. And they've got three guys wide open on the other side of the court. There we go. It's going to be 17 to 10. Not great for our team, but guys wide open in the corner for us. Bang, green light. 17 to 13 game here with about 20 seconds left in this first quarter. Again, the white team back with the ball here, working at the top of the key against Kingston TV. They're going up against a 60 overall point guard. That shot's off. I leave my guy, though, wide open from three, going for the rebound. And that doesn't work out too well for us. We are now in the second quarter. Um, yeah, I kind of wasn't paying attention to start off this quarter as well. And there's going to be a three in the corner as well. It is a now a 10-point game. We get the ball back here. I actually get to touch the ball. I go for the mid-range shot. It is off. Not great, but we're open the corner to the left. Bang! No, oh, we missed it as well. But we get the putback, so we do get some points on that possession. It's now 23-15 for the white team. And coming off a miss by us, another three. Deep shot right there for them. And they will hit it. It is now a 26-16 game. Will they make it 13? That shot is off. And we've got guys in the fast break. Kingston TV, 62 overall, something like that. Makes the layup. And the lead is now down it to eight. Can we get a stop on the other side of the ball? We will not. And I leave a guy open in the corner. Bang. It's an 11-point game. Um, but if you're wondering, yeah, the rec center is basically the exact same thing. I mean, I don't, again, I said it earlier in the video. What do you really change the rec center? I mean, I guess you could change the courts, but... I don't think anyone's complaining too much about this because let's be real. I don't think really anyone plays the rec too much. 
Um, I forgot Prion was even in the game too, so I guess we'll play some of that um, very soon here. But we're going to hit a three in the corner right there to cut the lead down to eight. But now it's back to 11. Kingston TV will find our center down low, but he kicks it back out in green light. That man is a monster. The dude with the star is absolutely carrying our entire team. Kingston TV now in the fast break looking. He's going to pump, pump again, and he's going to go up with it. Oh my goodness. A 65 overall, 62 overall has more points than I do in this game. Not a great look, but it's a five-point game now. It's 34-29. That shot is off, and the half-court shot is off as well. But now we go into halftime, only down by five. We were once down by, I believe, 13 at one point in this game. So not horrible. And, uh, yeah, really no animation right now for this halftime I mean, part of the game, we're just kind of standing here. And also, I'm one for five, but I guarantee you things are going to get better here. I only have two points, which, you know, not great. But hey, I'm a 78, still getting used to this build. Um, and yeah, we will now go into the second half of this game. Down by five by a score of 34 to 29. Look at the white team star player, too. He's got 14 points, shooting 100% from the field. Oh, my. Let's now go to the second half. So we are now down by eight. The score is 40 to 32. About halfway really here in this third quarter. Oh my! Big slam right there by the red-headed machine. And it's 40 to 34. That though is gonna be off. They get the board and I can leave the guy in the corner. He hits it again. It's a nine point game with three minutes to go in the third quarter. Now a six point game, but they got a fast break on the other side. That one from three is good as well. The score is now 46 to 37. With two minutes to go here in the third quarter. That shot, though, open the corner is going to hit. That guy is single-handedly really keeping us in this game. He's got 23 points so far. And we're down by six. Oh, my goodness. I've touched the basketball. I'm going to go up. Oh, no. That is not ideal at all. Oh, no. That's not what I was looking for. Okay, in previous years, I've been a slasher this way. I can really shoot more. But it's all right. We're going to hit that three in the corner. And again, I'm going to get better with this build in the near future. Just you wait. But we're only down by three. We can tie it right here with the three. We do. And in a game where we were down like 13 points, it's tied 46 to 46 with 36 seconds left here in the third quarter. We're now down by three, though. That shot is up and it is good. So it's a one point game of 49 to 48 with 25 seconds left to go in the quarter. That shot, though, for three is going to hit. It's 52 48 now in favor of the white team. We're going to try to get another stop here. The alley -oop is off. Eight seconds left to go. They left a man wide open on the other side of the court. Nice reverse slam right there. And we now go to the fourth. Down by two, now down by four. We are on the fast break right here, though. Redhead man going to find our shooter wide open. Bang. It is now a one-point game, 54 to 53. Two minutes left to go. I get the ball. Hey, it's my time to shine. We're going to go take it up right here. Let's go take the lead. Yes, sir. I mean, hey, if I get the, if I get the basketball... I can score, but I just haven't got it this entire game. We're going to now take the lead. It's 55-54. That man, though, their center is an absolute unit, and he's going to keep getting boards, and we're now down by two. It's 55-57, a minute 45 left to go. Here we go. Let's see if we can retake the lead or at least tie this ball game up right here. Our guy is going to hit it again, and they're going to say he hit that three. I thought he was over the line, but we'll take it. It's 58-57 with a minute 30 left to go. Can we play some defense? We leave him wide open, and he's going to hit again. Full white, but he hits it. 60-58 is now the score. The white team is in the lead with a minute 18 left to go. I'm open here. I'm not going to get the basketball. Oh, I am. Oh, my goodness. Yes, sir. Green light, we clutch up. We only have seven points in this game, but it doesn't matter. We've hit maybe the two biggest shots in this game, but now our team needs to get a stop. There is a minute left. We know this guy at the top of the key has been killing us all game. He's going to drive and score. So we're now down by one again. Will I hit another clutch shot? I don't know. It's 62 61. Here we go. 56 seconds left to go. We lag a little bit right there, but our star player has got it. He's going to kick it back to the top. He's going to drive it and he's going to score. All right, we're back up one with 48 seconds left to go. Can the defense shut them down? Here we go. They're going to drive it again. Kick to the center. It's off. And we get the rebound with 38 seconds left to go. Give it back to our guy right here and just let him work. 33 seconds left in this game. They will foul. It's a reach in fourth on that player, but 26 seconds left to go. We're going to kick to the corner. All right, I mean, hey, you got to get it to under 24. I get it. I didn't mean to take that shot. Like, I, I swear to you, I did not mean to take that. We get the rebound, though. Kingston TV puts it up, and a shot clock violation. Okay, I sold the game right there. I, I'm not going to kid you. Like, I, 
that was bad. I didn't mean to shoot that at all. I thought it was going to be a pump fake. It didn't work out for us. I had a guy wide open, but somehow we get the ball back, and it looks like we're going to be in control of this game. Eight seconds left, though. We got to hit both of these to go up by three. He will hit the first one, and the second one is good as well. So here comes, if we get a stop here, the game is over most likely. Shot in the corner, they leave him. Oh, and it's off, and I get the rebound. I mean, let me get my points here. Foul me. All right, here we go. We're going to the line. I got Larry Bird free throw on. I got to change this. This free throw sucks because of that. But, you know, I just, I missed it to make it interesting. Here we go. For the game, just like Anthony Davis, bang. You missed the first one. Make it interesting for the fans. And we win this game by four. By a score of, what, 62-62. We get the job done. Only put up eight points in this game. But it's all right. Again, only going to continue to get better with this build. And, folks, that'll do it for this quick rec center gameplay here. We win this one by a score of 62-62. to A very entertaining rec center gameplay as well. Again, we hit some big shots in this one. And our team will get the win. Also, you get a lot of XP playing this. So, I would suggest playing this one out. I know I'm pretty low right now in the XP levels just because I haven't played Park much. But... But I went from level 2 to level 4 in just one game. And Kingston TV went from 1 to 4 as well. So, folks, thank you all for watching this Rec Center gameplay. Make sure to hit that subscribe button down below for some more NBA 2K22 here on the channel. And Mamba, forever.